WYT.com. The growing problem of copper thefts has a power company fighting back. Kentucky Utilities has had more than 28 reports of stolen copper so far this year alone. The company will now use high technology, new technology rather, to trace and recover stolen co copper. KU says it also is using more copper weld in wires instead of pure copper. It's more difficult to cut and it's worth less money to the scrap dealers. KU is not the only one fighting back against copper thieves. New developments and construction sites are often considered easy targets because they're isolated. But now some builders are armed with a high-tech defense system. Mark Kennedy investigates the new way to keep thieves away. New construction, residential homes, uh, they usually enter from the basement. Allison Rudd and, uh, with Payne Homes uh, says copper way, thieves have been targeting their new development. And they have a machete or some type of... Um, knife and they just start cutting the wires at, and they're know. not alone all the copper was stacked right in that area right police there. say it's over the last lot, year right. with the downturn in the economy it's become a growing trend trying to steal copper from a church more than twenty five thousand dollars of copper copper thefts which they say are out of control the crooks are even risking their lives a thief was killed trying to steal copper all for a little bit of money but very costly to the builder. Thousand dollars each time they they break in. So Payne Homes is fighting back, <laughs> installing Tattletail, the latest technology provided by Lane Hart Home Systems. This unit can protect up to 16 homes within 2,000 feet of this unit. This simple remote unit is the first of its kind in Kentucky. Not only does it protect this home behind me, but also this one up here, as well as the one up the block. And not only that, believe it or not, it also protects the one about a half a mile away, this entire development. It's amazing that uh, we can put the monitor in one spot and monitor a whole area. Wireless motion sensors are placed at all the doors of the homes and connected to just the one unit. Any movement it senses automatically sets the alarm off and calls the call center, who all within 12 seconds either calls the police or the owner. These shingles were unique. There's none like them in Madison County. I spent a lot of money on them. Sue Smith is building her dream home. She says she invested in Tattletail the next day. I can't stand to lose more building material. So her shingles are wrapped up with a motion sensor on top. Any movement will set the alarm off. This can do your tobacco barn, your horse barn, your tack room. You can actually set this in a house and protect your entire farm. So thieves may want to think twice before they strike. In Madison County, I'm Mark Kennedy, WKYT 27 News First.